My name is Logan Kanapadi, MPP for Mark Antonel riding uh, for provincial county. Okay, uh, with the um, coronavirus now here already spread to Canada, so we, we would like to know what kind of precaution has the Ontario government is doing to protect the people here. The Ontario government is a good uh, is a good message in place, and uh, you know that is a, uh, we learn from the SARS experience, and uh, we uh, we have a system is mechanism put in place is uh, better than ever before, and uh, we have all lined up uh, uh, health measures put in place, and uh, we have a good uh, checkup uh, when the people. People are coming from, uh, especially Wuhan province, uh, when they are arriving in uh, Ontario Airport, uh, Pearson International Airport, and we have a good medical staff, medical health team, and frontline health workers. Uh, they are forefront of this issue, and uh, anybody has got viral uh, any infection, they, they could go to the family doctor. Then family doctor can refer to the public health. They call the public health, or even they go to the nearest hospital. And then we have a good medical system in place, and there is a wonderful doctors and frontline healthcare workers as well. Work side by side and we know that uh, uh, four cases in Ontario and uh, we, we, we had a uh, success story and we control it and they are in the, uh, the, the hospitals and, and, and these are the good news story and the, the health and safety of the province of Ontario uh, is a paramount, it's, it's important to our government and uh, our health ministers and uh, medical officers uh, of province, uh, they're doing the uh, as much as they can and doing a good job and and uh, people shouldn't be panicked. I know this is a crisis, uh, we, we, we've seen it and uh, my wife is a medical doctor, I'm, I'm, I'm a neighborhood, my, she's serving in a Markham resident for 21, 21 years at McCowan and Denison. Uh, even other days, uh, one patient walk in uh, from China and with the cough. And it's, 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 it's a normal cough. We are going through the flu season. And you know, in Canada, over 3,000 people die every year through the, the flu viral infection. So this is a, the, the, the coronavirus is another the viral infection. Uh, we have to face it, you know, it, there's so many things are happening, there's a, so many epidemics, so many is a plague, and uh, these are the reality, we have to face it in the positive way. We have to put the right perspective uh, into this, uh, the, the crisis, and, and not to stereotyping. There is a miscommunication uh, taking place among the communities, not only one community, there's a miscommunication, misconception, uh, misperception, and I'm here to support our, my Chinese brothers and sisters as a, as a former counselor for Syria Markham and uh, now I'm an MPP for the province of Ontario and uh, I'm, I'm, I show my solidarity and I stand with shoulder to shoulder. That's what I came here to this wonderful restaurant to with my good friend Alex Shuan and to have a food and we are going to uh, another Chinese restaurant uh, this afternoon and people shouldn't be panicked and you have to take the basic things. It's a common sense. Wash your hand very often. And, uh, and uh, take uh, when you are coughing and you cough uh, on your hands and and, uh, and don't you you avoid the, the avoid uh, some of the some of the places that you, you feel is not safety and uh, and, and continue your life as as normal and please support uh, one another this is a time our chinese community need love and affection and empathy and, and the, the solidarity and, and we have to we have to stand up with shoulder to shoulder this has happened to any communities you know this is a, please clear the the, the the miscommunication misconception uh, that's how we could uh, we could bring the the harmonious this, through this 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 difficult time this through this the the period we could bring the community together that, that's why they, we are here. Thank you for all the media to come here and, and taking this message.